What is up everybody? It is Mark again and welcome back to Swamp and Stomp. As you can see, I got my leafy suit on and it is turkey season. And I'm heading into a spot. I got some turkeys that have been roosting pretty consistently. Hopefully they do it again or did it again last night. I'm gonna go get in real tight, see if we can't get a gobbler down. Let's go check it out. A big deer. And he didn't go 30 yards. Oh my god. <laughs> that was the first buck I've ever shot. Woo! What a rush. Money. That deer is dead. Tagged out, baby. You shot one? Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. I saw him go what? down. Hey guys, I know this is a turkey video and everybody's thinking about turkey hunting right now, but if you turkey hunt, there's a good chance that you also deer hunt. And right now we are having the biggest sale we have ever had on our camo, which is specifically designed for hunting deer out of a tree stand. It has the sky in the background so that you completely disappear into the tree. We've got hats, we've got shirts, we've got pants, and we even have face shields. We have the whole outfit and everything is for sale right now for 30% off. Go check out our website at swampandstompllc.com or check out the link in the description. Well, that's not ideal. Bikes come riding in right in the middle of gobble time. Ridiculous. The shitty thing is that this bird that has been roosting in here, he would have been able to see them clear as day coming down this trail. So I suddenly don't have a whole lot of faith that he's going to gobble anymore. Frustrating as hell.
bird just flew down that I had no idea was there. Looked like a like another gobbler, but I don't think he's the boss. The other one is still up. As soon as he flies down, I'm gonna run up and try and cut him off. What's up guys? Michelle, my wife and I are headed out for opening turkey season. She was lucky enough to draw a pretty special permit to us. We just got to the parking area. We've got a few birds located. We're gonna get our stuff together, head out into the blind, see what's gobbling this morning. Anyways, I won't bore you guys. Let's get to the show. Four ten, baby. All right, guys. So Michelle and I are here. My blind is just out that way. We decided not to get in it this morning. The birds had been roosting right over there, but they weren't there last night. I opted to stay, stay hidden in case they gobble this way or that way on this tree line. I could possibly get into a better position. We were set, to set up for more of a pitch down spot. So we're just listening. It's like 621, 622 right now. They should be gobbling in the next uh, 10 minutes. I'm excited. How are you feeling, babe? I'm excited. All right. Hopefully they gobble their heads off this morning for us. Hopefully we can locate one. If not, it'll be running and gunning and we'll just be walking to find some strutters or something. Michelle and I are struggling to find birds right now, but the fog is just now burning off. We're just gonna keep checking pastures and hope we see some strutters. We see lots of deer so far. We're pushing a little doe right now. We're just gonna keep moving slowly. Glassing. 
see what we can come up with this morning. We haven't seen any birds in the pastures they were the past few days. We're gonna push further in, go check out some oaks if I can get to them. See, uh, see if I can find anything wanting to play. The day is young. We got time, we got time. <sighs> Y'all, go turkey hunting with your husband. A lot of fun. My shoulders hurt. I had the impression that we would be sitting behind a blind, restful, looking for turkey. No, we've been walking and walking and walking. All right, well, we are on the move again. Huh. Whoa, what's that? In the tree. It's Anahinga. A what? Anahinga, it translates to snake bird. Oh. Just stay here, I'm gonna pop out on this field. Does that mean I can sit? Wait a minute. friend here taking a little break we do that well when John is out there looking for her boyfriend you just be chilling working hard as you can see all right guys so Michelle and I have cobbles so this morning and we're gonna sneak across this pasture chilling like a villain over here. I just gotta get Michelle in the right spot. Alright guys, so to conclude uh, the end of our morning there we had Robbie and a couple of his buddies come try to help us kill one of those three that were left in the field. I think there were three different turkeys and then the four we had going around this morning. Um, but it's it's impossible to tell because I had four big pop gobblers in the field this morning and then, then right at the end we had 
two cobblers and a jake, which we didn't have a jake in the morning. But either way. Nice! Nice! Oh my god, guys. <laughs> Michelle's first bird. Look at this. It's a good one. <laughs> Let's lay that baby out right here. <laughs> oh my god, talk about some back and forth. They're shaking, Jack. That, that spur. Alright, we got like three quarter, maybe one inch spurs. But it's a beautiful bird, baby. Look at that. Look at them feathers. Look at that color. <laughs> uh, how's it feel? I'm like, I'm, I'm so proud of myself. You I'm just so good. I was shaking. Yeah. But I was like so confident for like the amount of like. You looked at me and you're like, I'm going to shoot it. And I'm like, just stop waving at me. <laughs> Uh, Did you see it? Like how No, I, I didn't saw see it at all. I saw him and I was like, okay, I Was got he all this. puffed up when you shot? No. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. He was alert coming he in. Was, yeah, and right when I saw this opening right here, I was so confident 
that like I just went for it. I lined it up and I like went for exactly pretty much where I wanted to shoot him. You did perfect, baby. I was he went shocked. right down. I was like, did that just happen? <laughs> and then like when I like got up, I started to like get emotional in a good way. <laughs> Like, well, well, we're gonna oh eat this. God, thank we're gonna you eat this guy. For your harvest. And you made it a quick, quick look. You hit him. You hit him perfect. All up in the neck right here. Oh my God, John. Yeah, his head is beautiful. Look at him. See his little waddle. Yeah. Uh, nice, nice beard. All right. Oh my God. All right, guys. I want to give a little. Little backstory on this beautiful, beautiful, look at those colors. Oh my gosh. I know, right? Look at that color. So this gun right here, this was my first gun that my dad bought me. It's a 410 and it's been sitting in the gun safe for, I can't tell you how many, probably 20 years. Cause we just don't use it anymore. And these days with, with the new tungsten shot for turkeys, the number nines, Man, she took this bird out at 30 yards like nothing. I, I'm pretty sure she could have done a 40. But wow, that is uh, one spectacular bird, baby. I'm so proud of you for your first, your first turkey. We hunted so hard on this hunt. 